Dr. Daines, um, you are a doctor, you're a fully quite qualified doctor of audiology and we were looking at your business card a few minutes ago and you've got an awfully lot of letters after your name. What do they all mean? They're all representations of my certifications that I have. Uh, I graduated from Utah State with my doctorate degree in audiology. I have a bachelor's degree in communicative disorders and deaf education. Um, and then I've also uh, have what they call board certification, which entails further education and further training after the doctorate of audiology degree. Okay, so very clearly not a fly-by-night operation here. You've spent many years training and qualifying and loving. I, th I get the impression when I see you with your patients that you love what you do. I do. I love, love this. I love enjoying sitting back with my patients, helping them out. I get a lot of satisfaction, take a lot of pride in doing a job well done. Yeah. And so the Danes family, been here for many generations in Cache Valley, um, again, homegrown uh, doctor in yourself. Um, what do you love about seeing your patients? They all seem to love you too, I will say that, we've noticed. Everybody has a different story. We have a lot of neat families here in the valley, a lot of neat people, and I enjoy meeting them and hearing about them and their life and seeing if we can make it better. After all, fa family is what's important. Those relations that we build with one another, uh, some of my favorite memories are sitting around with my grandmother, around with all the cousins when I was young, and those things are very important, and that's where hearing comes in. We need to be a part of those types of environments, not sit around and wondering what's going on. Uh, we, we enable people to be able to enjoy those things again. Yes, you do, because actually there's nothing worse, is there, than being in a crowd of people and you really can't understand what anyone's saying to you. Yep, and it affects your relationships with those people. Now, I noticed also here, uh, as we've been here a few minutes today, that you've had a, a couple of people come in and out um, without an appointment, just kind of needing a little tweaking, perhaps, a little reassurance. You're there for them all day, aren't you? Yep, we're here every day every Monday through Friday, um, and we don't charge for those things. Uh, if we can fix it here in the office and take care of it, we do it at no charge. Hear, hearing's important to us, and we want to make sure that you're hearing the best that you can. Yeah, and it's very clear when, when we've been watching you that you really do love what you do, and your patients are so comfortable with you. Um, tell us where you are and, and how to get help if people need it. I'm at 485 North Main Street in Logan, and you can give us a call at 753-HERE, H-E-A-R, or 4327. Okay, so if you do think you're losing your hearing just a little bit, like some of us of that certain age, come on down and see Dr. Danes and he'll sort you right out. Thank you.